It's important to make sure you sit down in your winter months and work out your key races. If once you've worked out your key race, then you can really set up a platform for your training over the winter months. If it's going from a shorter distance to a longer distance, then obviously you need to work extensively on your aerobic base. So improving your distance on the bike, getting those arm warmers out, investing into some good clothing, and making sure that you've got all the correct equipment to get you through those long, arduous months. Swimming is obviously an area that I like to personally focus on over winter because it's low weight bearing and it's also an easy way to improve, improve our aerobic conditioning. So improving that might be as simple as adding one extra swim session on the weekend. It might only be 40 minutes in the pool, but at least it's another session that you've included into your winter months. It's also important to sit down with your coach and go through a plan if you're, you're an athlete that tends to train on your own, maybe it's a time for you to start looking at different groups, different triathlon clubs, maybe investing into a coach. Because the one thing I know is that the coach likes to do all the thinking and you just do the doing. So it's important to actually allow the coach to do what he does and then you're accountable to him. So you've got more time to think about all the things you've got going on in life.